been on our turf, Consul. You That just hit little, little. They, they clipping. Yeah. No, and, sure. we got and that nigga yeah. biting on the bar nail. Oh, oh, man, I just watched that shit. And that, that nigga was oh, singing. Oh, that's the funniest shit ever, yo. <laughs> hey, hey, what's, what's up, everybody? Come on out again. No, he did. I thought about Ezeo shot on Friday. He said, ooh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, everybody? Yeah. This is Spike Punch. <laughs> we we are hip hop. <laughs> you are in the great debate place. Uh, tonight's show it's all R and B. All R and B. All R and B. So yeah, ribs and barbecue. What's up? It's red. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I don't know about someone wrote that volume. It's, it's well, like, we got it. Yeah, Let me see. We is it? We good? Uh, no, no, we good right hold there. Up, we hold good. Up, hold yeah, on. we working on the live. Baby. Yeah, we working uh, on uh, it. Uh, uh, we good. Tonight. Yeah, tonight is. Put your face on the screen, baby. Oh, oh, Billy Steve. Tonight <laughs> is specially made for my voice with the R&B. <laughs> we go to an R&B style. All right, yo, so the night show is all R&B, and uh, it's going to be fun. Switch? What, I ain't switch? He oh, no, we good, we good, we good, we good, we good, we good. And uh, I just want everybody to understand that tonight's show is going to be sweet, and for all you ladies tonight, chime in. Let us know what yeah. turns, what turns you like, on. It's like about to fuck. <laughs> what, what turns you on? Who don't like fucking? Yeah. He like. Gay, straight. Yeah. What, the Speaking Trump of who straight. don't like fucking, our sponsor. No, let me <laughs> No, <laughs> our sponsor tonight. Go ahead. Oh, our sponsor tonight, designonline.net. Graphic design, flyers, brochures, business cards, photos, web pages, designs. These niggas are stupid, but you can get in contact with any one of us. You want to get in contact with him? Oh, go to Design Detail on Facebook, um, his page. Hey, y'all niggas dumb, man. Hey, no, tonight is going to be a dumb ass show, man. Why? Why? Don't get rotten black ass. Right. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> all right. So, so what's up? What's let's up? go with the first. We, we doing a sing along tonight. We can sing. Uh, hey, uh, if I, you I, feel it tonight, well, don't sing. Yeah. Yeah. What? You gotta come on now. Yeah. Yeah. I carry it too. Now. I'm an alto yeah. nigga. Yeah, yeah. I can <laughs> sing. <laughs> yeah, it sound good. That's what I'm talking about. I can sing. I'm an alto. Go ahead. How you gonna say you can say what you all sound good? <laughs> <laughs> hey, I can still sing. Hey, sing like no matter what. That's right. Don't listen. Right. You know what I mean? I think I'm gonna be foul. Um, they got always singing in the shower. What's up? Did we do all the places that we at? No. YouTube, Aight. SoundCloud, Aight. iTunes, Aight. Spike Punch Show. Mm -hmm. Go to uh, Instagram, Spike Punch Official, mm -hmm. and Spike and Punch Biz. And then our website. Where you can get the merch and on Spike Punch Biz too. Yeah. SpikePunchStore.com. Oh, yeah. Look at that right there. Ooh, yeah. Brand new motherfucking shirt. <laughs> yeah, man. Get your shirt. Oh, we got a mob going with these t shirts. Hell yeah. Well, niggas only understand. We got a mob going with these t shirts. I missed the old Kanye. I missed the old Kanye. I the old Kanye too. No disrespect. We need that one. Yeah. I got to get that one. Mm -hmm. Here yeah. we go. I got to get that one. All right. That's right. That's Who's right. the king and queen of R&B? And, and, you know, being that we, Britney hit me up ah. and was like, you know, when when the little fake Lil Wayne little nigga, I don't know, what's his name? Oh, Who's sound like Jacquees. Jacquees. Everybody keeps saying he looks like Lil Wayne. He That's do look like Lil Wayne. Britney hit me up and was like, yo, we got to talk about this on the podcast. <laughs> My my reaction was, I don't think Sean won't talk about that shit. I don't think Sean won't talk about that shit. So I called Sean and so like, hell yeah, we can talk about that shit. You know what I'm saying? So we're going to let Britney start. <laughs> okay, Britney. Hold, Hold on. Hold on. Go ahead. Niggas talking about me. I make sweet love from time to time. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It might take I, some, didn't, I didn't count you it out. It might take some that hard me right. to get me there. Right. Hey, don't do that, baby. I said it was me. Don't do that. But we going to let Brandy. Right. That's what I think love. I, 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 think, I think making love is the music that's playing. Hey, you know what? <laughs> hey, look. Boom. So uh, real shit. For real. Of, today in Britain, we're going to let you go. But today in the barbershop, I, I, I was trying to let you go. We yeah, was right. like, we let it go, man. Go. <laughs> but we was like, what really make it R and B? And Foom saying that is really <coughs> yeah. what make me understand it. And is it's the music that cuts the talking in half. 
If you get to my house and I'm playing <laughs> Joe set, you already know. Look, you know man. what I mean? We halfway there already. Hey, listen, Wait a minute. Are listen, we talking listen. about slow jams? No, no, slow no. jams. Oh, hey, look, R&B. Yeah. Listen, well, like, man. Not all, listen. Not all R&B. Yeah. yeah. Cut the talking to half. Look, I fucked the bitch of Young Jeezy. Oh, Shit, you just fucked me. Hello. I fucked her the goddamn Joe Shit, I made you love her. Okay. <laughs> Was you Same on thing. Same was, was thing. your stroke on beat? Same what? thing, huh? What was it on beat? Was it on beat? Was it on beat? Was it on beat? Was it on beat, nigga? Yeah. 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 Trap. <laughs> I'm gonna live with my dick to get that fuck. To live with my dick to the folk cap. Yeah, 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 right. Hilarious. One and two and I, three and my four. My game, nigga. I said, ooh, yeah. <laughs> ooh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but you just said, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so. Okay, Brittany. All right, forgive me. Brittany, go ahead. Right, explain, explain why we talk about R&B today. Bring class back to this. Okay, so Jacquees <laughs> mentioned you. that he was the king of R&B. Mm-hmm. And okay. And started a whole debate on social okay. media. Okay. First of all, I feel like you cannot call yourself the king of R&B without having an album out. Mm-hmm. That's a good point. Okay. That's if you're only point. just doing covers, it's not. I mean, he's got like what two or three singles. Okay. That's about it. No I'm album. My yeah. guess is good as yours. Yeah. So like, I'm gonna check him out tomorrow. I ain't check him out, check him out I mean, today. He's not a terrible singer. I'm not I'm discrediting him. him. Is he a no, good I'm writer? Not. I don't know if he's a writer. I have no clue. You don't know. Dude, dude. He's dude. Done, He's mostly known for doing covers and quiz mixes, which is his version of his uh, other people. Okay. Song. Yeah. You don't get to say that. You know what I'm saying? You can't say. Yeah. You can't call yourself. Exactly. You can't call yourself the king. So, um, it kind of took the left turn because he, he said this generation's um, king of R&B. He didn't say nothing about the 90s. Okay. Well, that ain't a left thing. Right. Yeah, That's I mean, No, because the old heads say. came right. out of left field and was like, oh, no, you not, we are, this, that, and Well, that. the old heads just sit that ass down right now. <laughs> right. He's talking about right now. Right now, now exactly. You know, so, yeah, my, question is, my, thing, my question is, who the fuck is out right now? I would have to say the only one that's been consistent with it would be Chris Brown. Chris Brown. That's yeah. I thinking. wouldn't call Chris Brown R&B. I would what? not call Chris Hold Brown on, R&B. What, what do you I'm mean? A, I would call him pop more than R&B. I mean, he's done both. Yeah, but I would, I would, I would. Yeah, but Chris Brown actually, is, you he's more pop thing. than R and B. No, and I was R and B shit. On, but you I'm become gonna pop throw you when you one just get real popular. Right. Don't mean he's not making R and B. Yeah, but but he started out as R and B. I'm just wasting my turn. I'm gonna throw, throw you. I'm gonna throw you one though. I because this came to me through rock. I would actually qualify Trey Songz more R and B than Chris Brown. I said Trey Songz. I really would. Yeah, okay. R and B. So I can agree with you on that one. Yeah, I, I, I told you said Trey Songz. Only Trey Songz and Chris Brown. I got one that's gonna so, kill niggas though. Go ahead. All right, well look. I don't know who the f- Jaquees. Jacquees. Jacquees. First of all, R and B is dead <clears throat> in twenty eighteen. No, it's not though. It's not dead. I'm Roe James because dope you as got fuck. black. You got um, Daniel Caesar. Yep. You okay. Got, you got okay. Um, Jordan I, Lucas that's coming out. You got. It's, it's a Jordan Lucas is it. He. LMA. Mm, uh, LMA. I mean, you, you know what? LMA. Bryson Tiller. You got Bryson Tiller. What about Roe James? Do you like that nigga? Roe James dope as fuck. All right. She's female. We don't. We don't male. No, right we can now. do. I mean, no, it's all. It's all. Yeah, because it's, yeah. it's, it's queens. queens. We ain't gonna oh, leave yeah. you alone. Oh, oh, I didn't right. know we was doing it that way. Yeah, all right, we ain't gonna leave you alone. But let, let's 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 keep yeah, it. Yeah, you got LMA. You got her. You let's get her. Yeah. LMA. All the motherfuckers can't hold hold a candle to Mary J. Fuck oh, fuck him. you know you ain't listen to it yet. I listen to LMA album. That shit boring. Okay. Oh, no, her, her album good. LMA Rose album good. Her, her, album good. good. Her, her, we ain't talking about her. But she, that's what I just she, said, though. She in a class by her fucking no. self. We not talking about her. Not She's not in this conversation. Mm-hmm. Like, she too dope to be in this no, conversation. She, she, then she can keep me, keep me titled as queen. But we, let's talk about the males. Let's keep it on the males. All right. Why do you have to do that? No, we ain't keep it on the males. You're the pro-woman, but now you want to fucking. All right. I told you. Now you want to fucking I told you you're a chauvinist, man. Can I? Let me, let me. Let me make my point. Let me make my point. Bring this your man. Let me make, you know what I mean? Let me make my point. Make your point. Make your point, point Rob. Shout out JD. JD said Jacquez doesn't have an album. We don't he doesn't know. have an album, yeah. No. Okay. no, he said he does have one. Oh, he does have one? That's what JD said. Is that an one? album or EP? He got one. It sucked, though. It's something. Oh. Anyway, to me, oh, okay. Okay. Go ahead, Rob. my, my, my whole thing in this shit is, if you want to talk about who's running R&B right now, I would say it's Beyonce. Yeah. All right. Okay. But ain't she pop too? 
Yeah. She is, but, but she no, she's she not. She's also done both. Yeah. How you gonna excerpt from Chris Brown? That's what I'm saying. Like, how y'all gonna do that? You can't excerpt from Chris Brown. Chris Brown, man. I'll tell you what it is. I'll tell you why. I'll tell you why I do it. Rock for the point, Deshaun follow up. Here we go. I said Beyonce. Real R&B music to me was the kind of R&B songs that, that touch your soul. Talking about licking ass, it's not R&B music to me. Chris Brown. Somebody. Like, you licking ass. Niggas won't lick ass. I mean, niggas was licking ass. Y'all just talking about swallowing watermelons. Niggas was licking ass since the 60s. Y'all just talking about swallowing watermelon. Who? Beyonce. Yeah, that's, that's the difference. Oh. This new kind of R&B, <laughs> to me, I don't but look at it. But also go back and Hold forth, up. though. Yeah, me, myself, and I, she, she, she did that. You know what I mean? Okay. So, you know. She's just trying to keep up with the times. Okay. My point is that R and B music, you know, I think R and B music. I think about Gerald Levert. You know what I mean? Okay. Eighty-eight. So, uh, uh, you know what I yeah, mean? Yeah. Late eighties. That R and B music 90s. though, that like, real R and B. I actually so, agree with like, you. Like R Kelly, Usher. Usher could have said, "I'm the king of R and B." Nobody would have had a problem with that. You saying licking ass? Then you say R Kelly though? Then you say R Kelly? What? Yeah. Okay. Okay, well, don't do that. Okay, but don't, don't do that next time. We don't get started on I, Kelly with I, I, Dwayne okay. getting up. Uh, it, 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 it's not about what a nigga say. It's about the tone of the music. You know what I'm saying? And Usher's right. definitely R&B. Yeah, so, but, uh, so that's what I'm saying. I put him in the top. Right. Usher, Usher could have said, I'm the king of R&B. Nobody would have had a problem with that. If Bruno Mars said, I'm the king of R&B, well, nobody well, wait, would have had a problem with that shit. Bruno Mars that's just fair. put out an R&B album. The rest of his album was pop. All yeah. his other pop. Nah, but he still can say it. That last shit, and we still did that because it's some white, it's some white R and B too. His last album was pop. I mean, his last R and B was R and B. Bruno Mars shit was pop as a bitch. That shit was pop, but it was R and B too, though. If he said I'm the king of R and B, who the fuck gonna debate with him? That's what I'm saying. That don't make sense. These niggas ain't listening to Chris Brown. How the hell y'all put Bruno Mars on the Brown? These niggas don't listen to Chris Brown. Sean, I will easy. Sean, go ahead, Sean. That doesn't make sense. Super Bowl. That's fair. Nigga. Right. Super Bowl. But that that, that was, I, I was after the fact that he was trying to cross over to the more of the R&B I, side. Twice. All right, Sean has the mic. And I, I want to say this one time. Like, um, I, I feel like some element of in love or heartbreak has to be in a R&B catalog. Not record. Not one song. You okay. can rap about licking some out of ass. That's cool. That's R&B, too. If you got a be love record or a lost record <laughs> going behind the shit. Chris Brown don't typically make, he make balling records. His <laughs> first album was straight R&B. Hold on, That's man. the first record. Man, hold on. When he came out, 2000 what? When the last Chris Brown album you listened to? Um, I listened to all of them. I don't You know what Chris Brown's album I listen to? Exactly. The joke we had on the rap was rapping with this joke. You can't say that. Yeah, I listen to all I listen to Chris Brown. I don't listen to Chris Brown. Chris Brown Chris Brown is a pop star. But Chris he Brown got, got R&B music, R&B, dog. Exactly. He I got a lot say. of hip hop shit, but he got he got some R&B. He got some slow fucking records. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 Chris Brown got slow I, fucking I'm records. I'm gonna assume it. That, that's why I don't agree. He ain't Gerald Levert. Girls never ask me for a Chris Brown slow fucking record. I mean, never. You know, they asked me for a neo. Shout out to Rock. They asked me for a neo slow fucking record though. Two different generations, man. I was gonna say that, but it was gonna get at it. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What you were saying, uh, Brittany? <laughs> Neo can definitely be considered king of R&B. One, at one point, yes. At, at one point, at yeah. Point, yeah. At some point. At some point. At some point, yeah. Yeah, right. yeah, I, yeah. Can, I can Neo that. Yeah. I got one. I'll get that, that to the 10, man. I got one that a nigga threw at me today that probably to me was really the last nigga that could say, I'm the king of R&B. Miguel. No. I never heard a bad record Miguel from that nigga ever. Nice. Of R&B. I've never heard a bad Miguel record nice. from that Ooh. nigga ever. Maybe the, 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 the son of the prince First of, all, of have R&B, you seen, maybe. Have you, seen, have you heard Coffee? That's Shit. a fucking song. I, I ain't heard a bad record. Miguel rapper. got some fucking songs. <laughs> he likes Miguel. I'm the wrong nigga to talk about 20, 2018 R&B music. Prince, okay. I may be too. I'm the wrong nigga. Prince. I, I can't relate to yeah. these little niggas. And I'm saying, I know they he fucking, monitored, and they sing a song. This the one place you should relate. Under the umbrella to me. Yeah. Yeah. He's not Prince, but he fall under the yeah. umbrella. But this the one place you <laughs> should. And when they do, they go live, with the exception of people like her. You know what I mean? When they go live, they singing over their tracks. They singing over top of their tracks. Good call out to her, not too. Not all of them, all of them. Like, you got Daniel Caesar. I just said that. Oh, that's my oh, nigga. Daniel Caesar. That's my nigga. Daniel Caesar's dope. But, up. You you naming a couple, but I'm going at the majority. The majority of the niggas who claim their R and B in 2018 nowadays okay. are singing over top of their tracks. They singing right. trap records. 
They yeah, sing it on the top like, of like, their Most of the R and B singers, okay, vocal tracks. Most of the R and B singers records. sound like rappers. Yeah, they, like they Tory sing Lanez. trap records. They sound like rappers. Yeah, so that's that's why R and B is not. Then really. This is my question to you. I have to post it every week. Now I get you not understanding a rapper because he a young rapper is rapping about some shit you're already past. I get it. You know what I mean? I'm already past that lifestyle you live in. I'm grown man. I got kids. I pay the bills. But R and B, you're supposed to be singing about <laughs> fucking. You past fucking too? <laughs> you know I, what I mean? No, I'm not past fucking. It's What's just the R&B? that. What the new R and B nigga singing about? <laughs> I don't know because I can't. That's be... a good point. Huh? What are they singing about? You know what's crazy? Like if, new, if this new R and B niggas, what are they singing about? If they ain't singing about fucking. I think I, I think they more blunt. Oh, that's interesting. I think they more blunt. They say something singing about, about fucking. They taking rap lyrics R&B, and, and, and no, no, making them a lot. Back in the darn we grew up on, it was a smoothness to it. Even in the 90s, yeah. it was a smoothness to it. It was a talk you out your Yeah, panties. they talk about fucking, but it was a smoothness yeah. to it. Now it's like, come suck my dick. Bitch, you coming in the room, we gonna fuck away. I got condoms by yeah. the dresser, yeah. we fucking away. And alcohol and pills and all that yeah, shit. All that shit. Like. Yeah, I'm gonna get you fucked up, we gonna fuck. Let me raise this That's question. A good point. Let me raise this to, to Brittany, and I know you're a little older than some of the women that we got down speaking on, but... Would the old R and B even work on these bitches? Hey, yes. I love you. On, I miss on, you. I want well, you. Yeah. I need you. She'll be like, "You a punk ass right. nigga." You know no, what I mean? it'll work. Would it'll it work? work? Good I music so. is good music. Yeah, good music is good music. I think it'll still work. Mm, would it, it work? work? It depends on the female, man. Would it work? Wait, look, hold it, on. it'll work. Good song. It's always a good song with the message. Believe me, a, a shit. female love a nigga that can sing. Jump, All females love I mean, a good song. That ain't never gonna change. Yeah. We gonna but they, always. But go. none of these niggas sing. That's the crazy thing. Like young niggas, I miss I, niggas that sing like men. That's the right. thing I miss the most in R&B. Yeah. I miss you Charlie sound Burke, like my better Teddy hand, right. I miss Jaheim. Right. Niggas that sing like men. All these niggas, and this is the thing with R&B to me. And I'm make it quick. I always gotta say that. But anyway, I'm gonna make it quick. The thing that I miss with niggas now, all of y'all sound alike when you play it in the line. Yeah. And before I can get to know you, you go. You can't tell the nigga And another it. nigga has replaced you. Right. Mm-hmm. That's the and crazy I agree with that. shit. I don't know who's who. I don't know who the fuck you are. Right. Ty Dollar Signs, you sound like this nigga. I agree God with damn, that. this nigga sound like that nigga. I agree that. that nigga sound like that nigga. Everybody be- singing on the auto tune. And before yeah. I auto, get you know to you, you go. Right, that sound right. Before you establish why I That's should care, like you're R&B. gone. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. And I, Teddy ain't sound nothing like Gerald Avert. Turn up the right. lights. So true. All the old school artists sound it. Yeah. Sound like themselves. <clears throat> they sound See, like they missing, men. Yeah, yeah, they missing that. Hey, 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 they, was, they was original. Hey, yeah. hey, yeah. hey, hey was original. Speaking of Teddy, this dude told me, turn off the lights was about a bitch that, that was ugly. <laughs> Hilarious. Hey, fair enough. I, fair enough. I, I, I said, l- he said, listen to the song. It's cool. He said, he wanted to fuck her, but he just didn't want to look at her. It made me think. It well, made me light think. a candle, so I guess. Yeah, light a it candle. makes me think. She stink. Just to see her fat ass. Just it, to see her ass. It makes me right. think Teddy didn't care, care about girls as Teddy much as I do. That's the most favorite. respectful way I can say it. Because <laughs> I don't give a fuck what you look out, look like. You can cut the lights on or off. I don't give a fuck. I'm fucking. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Really yeah. doesn't matter. We fucking either yeah, way. Yeah, I'm fucking either way. I don't. So the difference with the R, I think. It just had to. It just ebbs and flows. It ebbs and flows, well, and that's what it's doing. It's it's ebbing with well, the times. This, this okay, I, I have say a question. I, yeah. Another person that t- decided to jump into this conversation as the king of R and B was Tank, and I feel he like needs he to sit the fuck down. No, he doesn't. No, oh my god, he needs no, to he sit don't. the fuck first down. Of all, he don't. Tank. First of all, he Tank doesn't. comes be- below the two members of the group that he was in. <laughs> cool. So, Hilarious. Cool though. And genuine. On top Hilarious. of the other niggas that said something bef- that said something after him, Give it he to is him, definitely me. at the bottom of the total. Why I disagree? Because he wrote Jamie say- Fox Grammy Award winning album. Tank wrote what that, that shit. What they gotta do with him? Because you're a- still writing the music. Oh wow! So he it can't, don't matter he can't that you wrote the music. Well, that's the case. Missy, I can literally Missy name Queen R and B. That's for the Simpson. Don't matter. Missy and Queen R and B. I can name four Smoke songs. Smoking Robinson. Dream. Don't matter. Oh, dream. 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 Dream.
Hilarious. Hey, 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 Hilarious. His sitcom was about singing. Okay. T-shirts and my panties sitcom. on was about singing. Until that nigga Tank wrote that album, that nigga did not win so a Grammy. So tell me why Tank couldn't write an album for himself. I thought T-Pain wrote a song for um, Jamie Foxx. Why Tank Fox. couldn't write an album for himself? I thought Neo wrote a song for Jamie Foxx. Fox. Yeah. I think he did. That's how writers go. I don't agree. Why yes. Jimmy Jazz and so Terry Lewis didn't sing, sing Janet Jackson records? Tank can sing. And Bobby Brown records. Tank can sing. He can write. He can write. Tank can sing, but why is song one as good as Jamie why, why, why didn't Jimmy And the nigga had muscles. Why? And he had muscles, nigga. And he still wasn't as good. Like, no one still yeah, was It don't work like that sometimes. No, you just said Why didn't Jimmy Jazz and Terry Lewis sing the Janet Jackson records? Or they the Bobby Brown records? They, 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 they didn't have it. But they were Because you couldn't. But they were songwriters. But you baby right. face wrote that shit and had it. Because they wrote the music. Oh, you not putting Jimmy Jam and Terry Lewis in the legendary R&B, motherfuckers? I mean, are you serious? serious? They, they the kings. Are you serious? They ain't no kings of R&B, though. They ain't no kings. No, they're debatable. How you gonna get them kings? They're behind the kings. Just because they wrote the music. They made the kings. No, they're not the kings. They wrote the music. They made the queen, too. Those niggas had the writers, though. If that's the case, we can throw Rihanna in this topic of being the king. You can throw her in there for me. All them niggas had writers, though, so they ain't really Rod Temperton is the king of R&B then, nigga. Cool. Nigga that wrote Michael Jackson shit, you nigga. Even though, even you though, get a nod. Even though, right. even though JoJo and KC with the voices, Devontae and them was right doing was all the music. Yeah. Exactly. All right. And they get a nod. is the king of R&B. Let's narrow it down then. Instead of, because we're going, oh, we're going, we're going to, about yeah, singers. Let's go to the singers. No, right. we talking about singers. Why, yeah. let's why, talk about two, singers. why two things can't exist in the they same can. space? They can. But for tonight. The writer and the singer are the same fucking piece of the outcome. You're the king of R&B, though. you you going to say Jerry Jam and Terry Lewis? I wish motherfucking Janet Jackson would say my career was all on my own without Jim and Jackson. She would never say that. She would never say that. So how did you do it? She but she's not going to say. So please explain to me about Madonna then. Because I know she Somebody had was writing that shit too. Exactly. And if she so would have waited long enough, the goddamn Force MDs would have been writing for her motherfucking ass. Lying, real talk. So Force MDs, Force MDs wrote some hits. Yeah, they did. They wrote some yeah. hits. You want to yeah. talk about a real king? Yeah, but look. Full Force wrote hits. Yeah, they did. But look. Yeah. 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 Full Force? Force yeah. MDs? If you, all them if you yeah. ask Janet Jackson. Yeah, that's what I meant, Full Force. I yeah. meant Full Force. Janet, yeah. who's the king of R&B in your, in, your, in your eyes? She's not going to say Jimmy Jam and Terry Lewis. No. 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 She should. She's not. What? No, they didn't say nothing. She fucking around might say Bobby. Hilarious. <laughs> that's pretty good. That's Shout pretty good. Shout out The Rock. Yeah. <laughs> Bobby was the fucking king, king too. Bobby could right. be king. All I'm saying is, could be king. Everybody, everybody got a job to do. Everybody. You the producer, you make the music. You write I'm gonna the deliver song. it. Right. You write the song, I deliver it. Who the king of R and B? Me or you? Exactly. Terry Lewis. And what? Jimmy Jam. That's bullshit. Yeah, yeah. I don't agree with that either. Nah, yeah, yeah. Man, they could have plugged any matter on top of that motherfucker. Hell no. Two that don't even make Hell sense. No. They could have plugged any matter no. on top of them two motherfuckers. Everybody know er, niggas, sound, niggas sing different. You could have gave, Quincy Jones could have gave motherfucking Keith Sweat the same album he gave Michael Jackson. Get the fuck out of here, phone. Get the fuck out of here. Hold on. Get the fuck out of here. What? What you talking about? Get the fuck out of here. What are you saying? No, what you saying? No, what you saying? Yeah, said that. both of them can exist at the same time. That's all I'm saying. You can't saying. hear Keith Sweat. You can't hear Keith like Sweat singing Thrillers up. Sing it, beat it. Oh, Thrillers up. Exactly. Nigga, <laughs> outfit ain't even right. Exactly. <laughs> My whole point. Hey, it Sweat don't matter. It, who wrote it? Mike ain't never it. had no chest hair, nigga. It's who singing it, man. That's all I'm saying. It's who singing it. Who the fuck who wrote it? Keith Sweat will kill that shit. Uh, Her two niggas sing the same song and shit don't care like right. no one. You I know what, Rock? Please. Keith Sweat and Killer Joe. Stop that no shit, Rock. Keith Sweat and Killer Joe. But that was the, beat it. Driller 2. That's what we got on the yeah, chat line. You know what's man. funny? I would uh, love. Keith Sweat would have had on some motherfucking loafers, nigga, and some. I would love to see that animated, though. Keith Sweat singing Michael Jackson shit. That should be funny. God. He said, Shout out Al said, Barry White is the king of RB. Okay. okay. At one point. Okay. Mm. Why not? okay. I would say, honestly, I would say Luther. I love Shit, Luther. Luther Vandross. I was thinking about him earlier today. Luther. Luther
Let's everybody give their king and queen, all right? Who that, wants to start? No, hold up, though. Hold this hold up. generation. Because we're going to say that. Yeah, that's two gray area. What, yeah. 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 Well, I, I, I get mine. Can we right. do two then? This generation and last generation? And I'm going to do overall ever, what would you do? forever. For who Who you prefer? Forever. Forever. King of R&B music forever. I'm, I'll have to give it to uh, Usher. Oh, <laughs> Lord. And then, as far as the queen, Beyonce. <laughs> 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 Beyonce. Beyonce, but Beyonce. Who you me, got, Brittany? I would have to say overall. Mm-hmm. That's what we're doing. Yeah. Uh, overall, I would have Who to you say prefer? Luther. Oh, that's good. I can go with Luther. I'll, I'll go with Luther. Go I'm all right with Luther. Luther. Yeah, I'll go with Luther. I originally gave it to Bobby, but then I was like, wait a minute. Luther I'm going to say, I say Usher because he just. No, I got it. You know, Usher was consistent. You done, Britt? Yeah. From the jump. You, when we was doing overall, I thought we was going to do two different ones. But, uh, oh, we doing queen. I already just, said Beyonce. Just throw out who you, yeah, you can throw it out any way you want. I said Beyonce for the queen, so. Uh, okay. I really don't think nobody has been as consistent no. as her. I agree with Brittany. Two out of three. Um, Beyonce now, yes. Um, Luther, all time. I'm, I can't <laughs> argue with it. Mm-hmm. But the king of R&B right now is Drake. <laughs> Dang. Straight up. Yeah. Drake yeah. is the but king so of R B so right now. Right. R and B? Right now. Yeah. Right now, Drake is the right. king of R B. I'm be serious. Okay. I'm dead. <laughs> I know you serious. I'm, I'm dead ass serious. I'll be serious. If I had to do right now, I would say Trey Songs. And I just, right, I'm gonna go I I, I still would give it to Drake. My king <laughs> no. My King of R and B. As much as, as as much as he a slime bucket, R. Kelly. Yeah, he okay. is a slime bucket. Okay. Um, I, that's that's you know all time. R. Kelly, I mean, man. That's R. Kelly is he fucking got, incredible, he got, he man. Smoking Robinson. R. Kelly, incredible, man. Smoking wow. Robinson. I mean, I mean, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Rewind. He sung it out. Rewind. Bro. Smokey was Rewind. Bad, dude. I thought we was doing. Smokey I thought was we was bad. doing the last two generations. Oh, it's so whatever you want. Oh, it's whatever you want. That's, 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 yeah, right. that's, that's right. right. one generation. Okay, all right, all right. I thought so too until so, Rock messed it up. Yeah, so, right, so enough, I'm gonna so. say um, R. Kelly and Mary J. Blige. Okay. Oh yeah, that's a good okay. one. That's fair. Ain't mad at that. Yeah, that's fair. Super fair. Yeah, yeah. I like everybody's jump. I mean, I really can't challenge me on the Drake shit, nigga. I'm telling yeah. you. Oh, yeah, I mean, I, I, that was pretty good. <laughs> that's weird yeah. that Drake is the king of R&B. I mean, I, yeah. I, that's debatable, so I, I get He's it. like I the only it. nigga still singing love right now. I get it. Yeah. I get it, too. That's what I, said, I get, I get it. it. Yeah. Ain't yeah. yeah. girls believe that nigga when you put yeah. that nigga on. They want all of what Drake talk about. I must be the only one that's not that into Drake. That yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I mean, I love his music. Like, I, you know what I'm saying, but that's about it. It's as far yeah. as it goes. Yeah. I don't want this nigga either, Brittany. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I've never been one of those females yeah. that got too involved into drink.